I'm a bitch. I guess I'm a bitch. What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, how are you? I'm Mika. Subscribe or not. It's up to you, no pressure, but seriously, subscribe. So anyways, today's video was inspired by all of the back to school videos that I have seen lately on YouTube. And these just made me wanna take out my senior yearbook and look back at the comments that my old friends had written to me. And once I read those comments, I knew that they were video worthy. So here we are. I think this is gonna be a fun way for you guys to get to know me a little bit better based on what other people think about me or thought about me which is probably not a good idea now that I think about it. <laughs> but yeah, it's too late to back out now, so here we go. I got my yearbook right here. I graduated in 2011. I went to John A. Ferguson Senior High School. First, let's take a look at my senior picture. How cute am I? All right, here we go, I found them. By the way, I only let like really good friends or people that I felt like affected my senior year in some way sign my yearbook. Random people would like ask me to sign my yearbook, like somebody that would be in my class, and I would be like, no. So, I feel like what I'm about to read is like legit the person that I used to be in high school and maybe still am. So, I think this would be cool. So, first one says, so, I remember how everyone would tell me you were mean. But when I got to actually know you, there's a lot more than others don't realize until they meet you. You're sweet when you wanna be, realistic and amazing overall, not to mention a beast at cheerleading. Also, after reading all of your Tumblr, I saw how unique and special you really are. Stop stressing your future. Girl, I still am. You're a strong girl and you'll do great. All right, next one. Where should I start? Well, in the beginning of the year, I thought different of you than how I do now. <laughs> Was I really that mean, guys? Come on. I love the type of person you are and I'm happy to say that we were on the same team when we won nationals. Yeah, girl. All right, another one. You're crazy and stuff, but still, I still love you. I'm glad I met you this year and I wish I met you earlier this high school life. I want to wish you the best in whatever you do in life. If you ever need anything, you know you can call me or whatever. Love you, man. Be happy. <laughs> I guess I was a very unhappy person. <laughs> Much hasn't changed. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Next. A cute girl with the definition of a fuck school mentality. I like it. Okay, I'm gonna stop right there. I never had the F school mentality. Just my senior year was a little bit rough since all of my friends had already left the school and I was pretty much like not by myself. I had my friends, but I didn't have as many friends as I had my junior year. So I guess I came off as like, I don't wanna be here or whatever, but that wasn't really the point. Like maybe a little bit, but not to this extent. Always quiet, but funny. First one to come in from lunch. Oh my god, I'm such a loser. <laughs> Next, fea. For those of you guys who don't know Spanish, fea means ugly. Wow, I hate the fact that I didn't get to know you before. I thought you were just a spoiled little cheerleader, but you ended up being one of the most amazing people I've ever met. Thank you for being there for me when I needed it. Just know that I'll be there for you whenever you need me. I fly. Oh my god, that's so nice. But you see another person that thought that I was a spoiled little cheerleader and that I was mean and that is not the case. <laughs> Another one. Out of all the girls I know, you're going to be one of the girls I will miss the most. <laughs> Mi corazón. I don't know why, but you became one of my best friends. I love you. And one day we will get married after you and your boyfriend break up. <laughs> oh, he also did a, a nice little illustration here. Let me share it with you guys. Look at that. It's a penis. Next, you're a bitch in a cool way. On to the next one. You're one of the few girls in this school that have a brain and a personality. Thank you. These things are really making me feel good about myself. Not gonna lie. I hope to know you for a long time. I'll see you in Miami Dade. I love you, 666. <laughs> and he also did an illustration and this was the best thing ever. This made my yearbook. All right, 
And what that is, if you don't notice, it is a devil just in a Top Gun uniform. And if you don't know what Top Gun is, no, it's not the movie. It's the best all-star cheerleading team in the world, which I was a part of. He obviously knew that cheerleading was my life back then, so this was like the perfect illustration of me. Okay, this one is from my ex-boyfriend, so this is gonna be juicy. <clears throat> I have way too many memories with you. I don't think anybody knows me as well as you do. Even though you really are out of your mind. I give up. Next. When I first met you, I thought you were one of the meanest people in this school. Why? But after having a class together and getting to know you, I realized that those were just rumors. You're honestly an extremely amazing person, and I'm so happy that you were a part of my life this year. Thank you for everything. So yeah guys, that's all for today's video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I'll see you next time. Bye! I'm gonna go cry now.